Welcome back to Chemistry Made Easy with Right Edu. Now, this is the part 2 video on Delta's Law of Partial Pressure. And this talks about collection of gas over water. Now, when a gas is collected over water, it simply means that the total partial pressure of that gas is equal to the sum of the partial pressure of the gas and the sum of the partial pressure of water vapor. Now, mathematically, this is what I mean. When a gas is collected over water, the total partial pressure simply equals the partial pressure of the gas plus the partial pressure of water vapor H2O. Now, this is the formula for solving questions pertaining to collection of gases over water. Now, this is an example. The question says, what is the partial pressure of oxygen gas collected over water at standard atmospheric pressure and 25 degrees Celsius if the saturation vapor pressure of water is 23 millimeter mercury at 25 degrees Celsius. Now, you can see this question and now to know questions that that talks about collection of gases over water, you simply see the statement which is collected over water. So when you see this, you know you are solving, your formula should be this um, um, aspect, which is Pt is equal to P gas plus P water vapor. Now, let's bring out our parameters out. Now, you can see this says, the question says, what is the partial pressure of oxygen gas? So that is not talking about the total partial pressure or talking about the partial pressure of water vapor, but it is simply talking about the partial pressure of the gas because oxygen is a gas. So what is the partial pressure of oxygen gas? So it simply means we are looking for P gas. So we just make it X. P gas is equal to X. Collected over water at standard atmospheric pressure. So S A P standard atmospheric pressure is simply 760 millimeter mercury. Because um, the other parameter is in millimeter mercury. So we have 760 millimeter mercury standard atmospheric pressure. If the saturation vapor pressure of water, which is SVP of water, is equal to 23 millimeter mercury. Now this says, what is the partial pressure of oxygen gas? So we simply bring out our formula, which is Pt equals to the P gas plus P water vapor, pH2. Now, the question asks itself, what is Pt? Pt is the standard atmospheric pressure in total, which is 760 millimeters mercury, and this is P water vapor, which talks about 23 millimeter mercury. So we will see P gas is equal to making this subject is we simply guess P total minus P water vapor. Now P gas is simply P total, which is 760 millimeter mercury minus 23 millimeter mercury. So we get our P gas to be that is um, 7 TV 7 millimeter mercury. Okay, now this is how to solve questions pertaining to collection of gases over water. Thanks for watching.